Hello everyone, I'm Joe and welcome back to another video and damn you sticky keys Okay, there we go. So hello everyone. I'm Joe and welcome back to another video. This is episode number Four yeah episode number four. I lose tracks way 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 too easily It's just horrible, but um Yeah, so I've got something pretty exciting to show you, um, so yeah, that should really be pretty cool, um, so, uh, yeah, so, let me just get a saddle, uh, I already have one in my inventory, that's brilliant, I've got 34 levels, so we need to enchant something new, uh, or combine some stuff, uh, I think I might do some combining, my pick is getting to the end of its life, so I might craft up a new one, or AFK fish for a mending book. Um, so hang on, Skype disable, please. Do not disturb. There we go. I should really remember to do that before recording. But as you can see, um, here we have like some horses, and these guys have been here for I don't know how long, because uh, I, I literally just logged on today. And all right, hang on. How fast are you? Meh. You're 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 quite a good horse actually. Jump height. Oh yeah. Hang on. Let, let me just get some blocks. Okay. So let's um dig out a bit of this mesa here. All right. There we go. All right. I will test out his jump height. All right. Can he jump two blocks? Yes, he can. All right. Can he jump? This, it, he can't even jump three blocks, that's appalling. But his speed is quite decent, so I'm gonna check with the other horse, see what that's like. Alright, I'll, I'll, I'll just leave you here, horsey. Alright, let, let's try and get this guy. Alright, let, let's see what this guy's made of. Alright, not as much health. Alright, now I can come off this guy. Alright. It seems like all of them have atrocious jump height, but let's try this guy's jump height. Okay, so two blocks high, can he make it? Yes, he can. I think every horse can clear that jump. Um, yeah, can't clear a three block jump, so I think this guy with the more health should be more worth it. Um, so let, let's just... Uh, Get the saddle off of this guy, and uh, let's get the saddle on this guy. And as you can see, much better horse. All right, so we might as well name our horse. Uh, let me just find the name tags. There we go. There's our name tags. And what's this depth strider? Not bad. I don't remember what's on my enchanted books anymore because I've got so many of them. All right, let's rename this name tag. What should we call this? Hmm. I'm not sure. This is tricky. Uh, Gerald. Brilliant name. Brilliant. Brilliant. All right. Let Let's rename this sucker, just to signify this is our horse. All right. Come on. Actually, actually, that's that's dumb. That's dumb. We need to rename it something different. Something more creative. Duo's mum. There we go. There we go. Much more creative. All right, let 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 let's put this on our horse. Can we? Okay, there we go. We've uh, renamed it to Duo's horse. That's um, that's uh, creative, I guess. Well, guys, I just had a close encounter with this guy right here. Oh. Oh, you can't back away very quickly at all. All right, this this horse is sucks at backing away, but I think that goes with every horse. Let let's just get this guy um back into his pen. All right, we really need to create a more sufficient pen for this guy, cause this this is not good living conditions. So I think uh, for today's episode, we're uh, we're gonna do two things. We're gonna build a horse stable. And we're also going to build our first shop. 
Um, and we're going to make it all western-like, and I think it's going to be pretty cool. Alright. Alright, there we go. Alright, let, let's try and take this guy out. Come on, there we go. Alright, nailed it like a boss. Off the corner of my eye, I saw something emerging here. Right, let's, let's just take out this guy before he gets out of hand. Ow, he actually hit me. Alright. Come on. Right, we gotta get closer each time. These skeletons are actually kind of easy to kill if you got a shield. Oh well, he's dead. Alright, let, let's go check this thing out. Um, Alright, so it's like... What's down here? It's literally just a couple of corridors. AFK fish farm? No, but they've got coloured rainbow sheep. That's, that's pretty cool. Um... And what's up? Uh, oh, that's a thing. We can use name tags at our disposal now because we got that AFK fish farm. Yeah, we pretty much got name tags out the wazoo. All right, I'm I'm interested in what that is up there. Oh, okay. Come on, let, let, let's. All right, there we go. Let's just eat the chicken, and let's get up here. I really want to check this out. Okay, it looks like um, a tree farm, by the looks of things. Um, I did see the redstone clock. Alright, is it? Yeah, it's basically a tree farm. And then he's got all the bone meal in there. I want to know whose base this is, because I'm fairly intrigued by this. I think this could turn out to be something quite good. And then, of course, we got Ceramics base over there, which is looking absolutely awesome. So, let's get back with what we are going to do for today.
Okay guys, so um, I finally finished this build and it looks awesome. Uh, not to burst my own bubble or blow my own trumpet I think the term is. I'm not really sure, but I love it. Um, it turned out way better than I expected. Uh, as you may know, western builds are way out of my comfort zone and I still pulled something quite awesome off. Um, I'm, uh, the inside I'm not really too sure about, of course, because, like, it's a western build and it has, like, sort of a curved roof. I really don't think it fits. Let me know what you think in the comment section. And also, I need to put some carpets here to hide the, uh, bare logs. But aside from that, um, did I bring, oh, I didn't bring chests. Uh, but this is going to be a name tag and shadow, shadow, saddle shop, so... Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, so we're gonna have our own like, uh, our own saddle and name tag selling service on the server. So I think that'll be pretty cool. Um, I'll just do. Will that be enough? How many will this make? Oh yeah, that's double what I actually need. Okay, my math sucks. Um. Alright, let, let's just make a couple of signs to go with that. Alright, let's get over there. Okay, so now that I built this, uh, okay, now, which one is this? Name tags, okay. So let's put all our name tags in here, uh, for anyone who would want a name tag to collect. And the shadows, as I previously called them. Uh, let's try and arrange them in quite an orderly fashion because I'm not really a fan of this whole, um, this whole, what do you call it? Oh my god, I'm making like a really stupid pattern. Alright, there we go. I like that. How'd that work? Would that? Yeah, I think that'll work. Uh, so that's our saddles and our name tags. So we got quite a few of those, um, and yeah, we're going to be pretty stacked in a few episodes once we come back to this place. Alright guys, so for the final part of this episode, we are not going to be doing the horse stable unfortunately, we do not have time, but one thing we're going to be working on is an Apoca bow of awesomeness. So I've got quite a few good bows here, um, oh that's a lot, that's quite steep. Alright, six levels, I will take it. Power four, that's power five now. Alright, add flame, other way around, 22. I think I can afford either way, okay. So I have to mi miss out the punch. Alright, what about unbreaking three? Okay, I think we've, uh... Ooh, that's, that is, that is expensive. Okay, so we w we're not going to get the most OP bow in the game. But it is a pretty amazing bow. I think I will take it for now. Um, what was on this uh, punch? Oh, I already have punch too. Okay. One more thing I wanted to combine. Efficiency 5. There we go. Um... And now I want, oh yeah, I wanted to uh, repair my uh, diamond pick. Okay, let's do that super quick. So we're basically, uh, I want to test this bow out, see if it actually repairs, because you know, there might be a glitch with the mending enchantment. I will doubt it, because it's the full release of Minecraft, but you never know, there could still be a few bugs, like there were, the container, the minecart chest said container.minecart, so you never know, there may be one or two bugs still left in the game, but... I want to show off something pretty amazing. Uh, it's in Kyle's base. My god, this looks so cool. Uh, so if you don't know where I am, I am at Kyle's base, or if you don't know who Kyle is, that's basically k -Sors. So I'm at his base right now, and this place looks awesome. Uh, so basically, uh, if you want to check out what Kyle is doing, or k -Sors is doing, uh, I'd recommend go checking out his channel, because... He is a really cool, awesome guy, and I would 
re recommend checking him out. I like wait for literally every single one of his videos. It he his videos are just awesome. Just check him out, guys. And he said he was gonna build a shack with Emsors, but apparently he never actually did that. Hmm. Maybe a building consultancy job. Oh wait, that's the thing that we were going to discuss. Uh, the building consultancy. Uh, now I did one last season. And I think it went down pretty well. We got loads of diamonds from that thing. Uh, we, um... Yeah, um... Basically, if you don't know what the building consultancy is, and you're probably... Then you're probably, like, quite new to this channel. Uh, basically, the building consultancy was in Season 2. And basically, it allowed people to enter their names into, um... Into, like, a building consult in like the chest um, along with a payment and they would basically and then we'll basically chat with th that person on Skype and then basically build something together that uh, would look pretty awesome so that was the building consultancy and uh, also let me know guys should we bring the building consultancy back this season because I'm fairly interested to see what your guys' opinions are on that uh, subject, and I'd really like to know. Next episode, we really need to get on to, to working on the storage station, because, I mean, we may only work on the aesthetics on camera, but I, w I will do all the organising off camera. But anyways, I am going to end off today's video here. If you did enjoy it, please be sure to leave a like. Trapdoor, please. Yeah, I'm going to end off today's video here. If you did enjoy it, please be sure to leave a like and maybe even subscribe for more. But anyways, I am Duo, and I will catch you all next time. So, I will see you then. Bye.